Hmm, what beer do I want to try next? Beer time, it's beer time with the beer man. another one for you and it is from Braveheart Brewing. It was actually kind of confusing because on the can it says brewed and canned by uh, Silver Moon Brewing Company um, and I've heard of Silver Moon but I didn't know maybe they're a collaboration maybe they're one of those lease uh, where they brew in their facility kind of place things I don't know I'm not sure exactly. I've seen uh, Braveheart on uh, YouTube and I, 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 I kind of wanted to I've been wanting to try their stuff because it looked really interesting. So, and I finally got one, so it's kind of cool. This is the Frogman. It's a 7.5%. It's an Imperial Red Ale. I like red ales. Nice, nice and, you know, like a malty toastiness with this crazy hot bite to it. So, um, I'm kind of looking forward to this. I don't know. These are one of my favorites. So, um, along with IPAs. <laughs> so, let's, uh, let's, excuse me. So, let's go ahead and open this up. Got about a finger head. Right on. Let's go ahead and smell. Whew. Yeah, it's got a nice malty rhythm going on here. I'm really liking that. Like um, like a kind of a, uh, a toasty kind of malt smell going on. Rich, somewhat sweet. Hmm. Some caramels, even a little, even a slight pinch of whiskey coming out, uh, barrel agedness. I don't know, something weird coming out of there. Some woody, let's say earthy or woody, woody fragrances, along with that malt and that sweet and that caramel, the toast, um, bread, bread toast, you know, like toasty bread. Ah. Maybe a slight pinch of biscuit in there. Maybe a dark, maybe a night, a, a, just a small hint of cherry underlying it in the nose. I don't know. I, I don't know. Just kind of what I'm smelling here. Let's go ahead and look at this. So we have some good lacing. Um, it's a nice red colored beer. It plays the part. It's copperish red. Um, um, is that mahogany? It has a nice tannish colored head with a fairly firm foam going on. It's pretty firm, pretty... It has a, a few smaller and bigger bubbles in there, but not totally uh, huge bubbles or anything. Very firm, very frothy. Very silky, also. Medium rising bubbles. Yeah, medium to rising bubbles. Let's drink. So it's pretty smooth, a creamy mouthfeel. It kind of goes on real relaxed. There's no carbonation totally lifting up. But what gets lifted up is the flavor of this slight, just a very slight cherry-likeness going underneath it with this sweet, caramel, toasty, biscuity kind of malt pushing up to the palate and back to the tongue about three quarters of a way back 
it starts to bitter off and get kind of tangy around the edges of the tongue. It starts to finish off at about right before the waterfall. It starts to, it lets you taste what you need to before it starts to dry off. But I, I actually liked, I liked how this all felt in the mouth. Like this was really, the mouth feel was very relaxing and just very calm. There wasn't anything, like I think this would have been very good warm. This was very good. It has that, like that cherry caramel. There's some caramels coming out of it. It's just very, it's a medium body in the texture. A light, let's, a medium body, but it just tastes a little, I guess, I guess just more quenching, more thirst quenching, more, um, it just feels good to take down. It's easy drinking. does bitter off yeah about 75 but it uh, percent of the way down but it, it kind of stays wet it doesn't really totally dry off hardcore all right guys this is awesome very good beer out of five hops I give this 4.75 hops very very delicious definitely try it if you're in the area if they do distribute somewhere else look it up if you can get it they're out of uh, Portland uh, let me look up the can I want to say maybe even Bend, Oregon, actually. Uh, but yeah, right on. So comment, let me know what you think. And if you've had it before, let's uh, compare notes, please. I love the comments. If you're new or not, subscribe and hit that bell. Hit that bell. Come on, y'all. Hit that bell. <laughs> and uh, please hit the like button. That'd be great. Thank you so much. You guys have a great day, night, wherever you're at. In this world, yeah. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Peace. I'm out of here, man. I'm out of here. But I gotta have a drink first. I'm <laughs> sorry.